babies, my lovebirds. Valentine's Day is around the corner and I'm not waiting until Valentine's Day to show my husband and my loved ones how much I love them. So today we're going to be making some chocolate, chocolate chip muffins. And I'm going to be making these for my husband specifically because every single day when he goes out on his truck route, he picks up two, sometimes three Wawa muffins. He is a chocolate fan. You know, he loves like any chocolate cake and he eats them, you know, every day. Like if he buys three, he'll eat one a day, you know, but he's always loaded up with his muffins. So I wanted to make this recipe just for him. And I found this recipe on TikTok. So I decided to follow it, but add my own twist. So we're going to be adding a half a cup of milk to one half a cup of flour, one half a cup of sugar, and then I'm adding one fourth cup of sour cream. So I'm just going to beat that all together and let it, you know, become like one, <laughs> just like marriage. Anyways, um, after I mix everything up, I wanted to sift out my cocoa powder because if you can tell, cocoa powder, it, it hardens up a little bit. So you want to make sure that you strain it so that you can uh, get like a nice smooth texture. So now my cocoa powder is perfectly smooth, no lumps, and we're able to make a perfect cake batter or a muffin batter in this case. Now I'm adding the rest of my milk. I like to add my milk in increments because it helps with the powder residue everywhere. So if you add a little bit, like as you can see, it's still pushing out. Um, I did buy me a new paddle because this one is too strong. And then my other one is all chipped up. So I did order a new paddle um, because this one is like, it creates too, too much mess. So it's good to like add liquid as you go so that you don't get too much powder everywhere and you know, you have to clean up more. Um, anyways, I wanted to show you these eggs real quick. These, this egg specifically is from my husband's friend's farm. Um, he has like chickens in their house and they always send us fresh eggs from their farm. And I appreciate it so much. And they come in these beautiful colors. They have blue, green, RNG, brown. So the eggs are so beautiful. Anyways, um, to the batter, we adding, um, what else we just added? I got to go back. Okay, so we're just going to add that one egg. And then if you notice, I put um, one tablespoon of coffee. I use Bustelo Cafe and like one fourth a teaspoon of salt. 